Hello, welcome to Fact and Day, the series where I bring you at least one fact every single day for as long as possible. Now today's fact is how oysters are able to change their gender and how they breed. Oysters are born as larvae that swim until they find a protective hard surface. They then attach themselves to this surface and become immobile for the rest of their life. Many people find this immobility problematic for breeding, so let's look at how oysters solve this problem. Oysters are born with sexual organs that can produce both semen and eggs. However, they can only produce one of these at a time but they have the ability to change which they produce at any given time. Strangely, all oysters are originally born as males and within a few years change into females and then can change back and forth in between genders continuously until they die. When a male oyster decides it's a good time to breed, it releases hundreds of thousands of sperm balls, each containing thousands of sperm. These balls then dissolve and release this sperm over a massive area and have even been known to make water a milky white color. When other male oysters notice competing sperm they release their own in hopes to beat whoever's they've sensed, and when females sense this sperm, they release their eggs. And then it's just up to chance for the eggs to be fertilized and develop into larvae to repeat the oyster's life cycle. But anyways, that's today's fact. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a thumbs up. I'd very much appreciate it. And subscribe if you'd like to hear more daily facts. And as always, thanks for watching, and until next time, have a good day.